Hey guys, welcome back to Kali J's Kitchen. Today I'll take you back in the kitchen with me and I'll show you how I prepared my carrot rice. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like, share and comment and tell a friend to tell another friend about Kali J's Kitchen. You can also follow me on Facebook, it's Kali J's Kitchen. Follow me on Instagram, it's Kali Kitchen underscore one and go ahead and follow my business page, it's Accessories by Leams. So here I have some garlic. I also have onion and bell peppers. I'm going to use some Kerrygold butter and this is the Irish butter and olive oil. I also have my freshly grated carrot. And I also have my white rice. Now, if you want to use brown rice, you can go ahead and use brown rice. So the first thing that I'm going to do, I'm just going to go ahead and wash my rice. All right. All right, guys. So now it's time to start preparing the items for the carrot rice. So the first thing what I'm going to do is I'm just going to add some of the butter to my pot that I'm going to cook the rice in. And as you can see, I'm just going to cook a small amount of rice, not too much. And I'm also going to add the onion, the bell peppers, and the garlic to the pot that I'm going to cook the rice in. And of course, I'm just going to allow this to fry for roughly a, a minute or so. Then I'm going to go ahead and add the carrot. Now, a lot of persons might see that I did not add any salt to this rice i'm not going to add any salt at all now if you want to go ahead and add salt you can go ahead and add salt but i'm not adding any salt at all as you can see i went ahead and add the freshly grated carrots and of course i'm gonna go ahead and combine both the carrot and the seasoning together with the butter then i'm gonna add my washed rice and this is basically one cup of rice that i'm using so i'm gonna add the rice and also guys if you want to use coconut milk to cook your carrot rice you can go ahead and add coconut milk So once I add the rice, what I'm going to do, I'm just going to go ahead and combine the rice, the carrot, and the seasoning together. Because you want to ensure that the grated carrot is evenly distributed. So I'm just going to go ahead and combine all of that together. Then I'm going to go ahead and add some water. And again, I'm just going to add basically one and a half cup of water and I'm just gonna leave it to come to a boil then I'm gonna come back and show you what it looks like alright guys so this is what my carrot rice looks like so I turn this down on the lowest heat possible so now what I'm gonna do I'm just gonna go ahead and and Add a piece of foil paper over it over the rice sorry just to let it steam properly because we want our rice to be really shelly and we're going to leave it for roughly another five to seven minutes for it to steam because we want it to cook properly and we also want it to be shelly we don't want a softy softy rice so I'm just gonna add the foil paper over it and leave it and come back and show you the final product of my carrot rice and we're going to serve this up with some oven baked chicken all right so remember to subscribe remember to, remember to follow me on all social media platforms on facebook it's kali j's kitchen on instagram it's kali kitchen underscore one and follow my business page it's accessories by leans so guys, this is the final product of my carrot rice. And as you can see, I served my carrot rice up with some oven jerk chicken and some country style vegetables. I hope you enjoy this video. I hope you try this recipe and I hope you tell your friends, tell your family members about Kali J's Kitchen. Until next time, guys, see you tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching and bye.